Welcome to your CCS Sports News of this week. First up, we have a volleyball tournament. There is actually an extended date, but you can still join a team if you want. There is a minimum of six players on a team and a maximum of ten, but there has to be two girls on the court at all times. Next up is a basketball scrimmage this Friday. Um, it is at the DePaul Cristo Ray in Cincinnati, and the game starts at 6.15. We also have a swim meet on Friday. Next is the Athlete of the Week with Scotty Hyatt. Welcome to Athlete of the Week with your athlete, Scotty Hyab. Tell me, would you rather run a race with crutches or do a marathon in a wheelchair? Definitely a marathon in a wheelchair. Wow. What would be faster, a cheetah with a rocket taped on it or a car driving off a cliff? A cheetah with a rocket taped on it. That's crazy. How much trash talk goes on during a game? Not much at all. It's, everyone's pretty chill. That's lame. Now, I'm going to give you the Scotty Hyab Award. Thank you. Welcome to this year's 2022 CCS Mock Election. Our two candidates are Faith George of the, of the FNAF Party and Christina Tora of the Fiesta Family Party. Our two candidates are going to give us their party issues and share why they uh, think you should vote for them. Ms. Tora, you are first. The Fiesta family has four issues that we are focusing on. First is vending machine inflation. We aim to work with Mrs. Toro and the business class to see if we can get back the prices down to where they used to be, or at least close to where they were. Next is elementary extension of recess. We wish to impose five extra minutes for the elementary students to play. Next, we have middle and high school lunch extension to have a longer time so that they can rest and relax and get back to class and not be rowdy and be able to be focused and pay attention. Next is the Calvary Cram. We wish to use a spreadsheet for all the teachers. That way the tests are spread evenly among the week and that there are not too many tests on one certain day to avoid students having excess stress during the Calvary Cram. Ms. George, your issues please. All right, I'll keep your time brief. Temperature regulation. Keep classrooms at a steady and comfortable temperature. How are we supposed to learn in the Antarctic or the desert? Next, clean water. Safe and purified drinking water for all. No antigens. Third, no school on rainy days. How are we expected to get up and go to school on a rainy day? It's too dangerous. Um, fourth, finding the buried treasure. We will find it. <laughs> 